Man, that is so freaking freaky, dude. Oh. Hey, check this out, man. I was uh, kind of walking back through the woods toward the truck. It's actually a little more open in here. And I happened to notice, it looked like there are like these plants right in a line here, which is odd for the woods. I got to looking at them, and I think these are ramps. Ramps are kind of like a weird garlicky onion thing. Yeah, those are ramps. Um, I don't really ever hardly ever see them around here. I've seen them in the mountains and I've seen them in the next county over, but isn't that weird? Look at it. I wonder if somebody planted them. Look at that. They're almost evenly spaced. And they curve over. <laughs> oh, those gotta be planted, dude. There is no way those grew nat. I don't know, could they grow naturally like that? Comes to here, here, and back, circles back around. So either someone planted those, there's some weird freaking witch that lives in this wood that makes them grow like that, or something weird's going on. I've never seen ramps grow like that in my life. That is bizarre. It's almost like a big question mark. That's gotta be like something a freaking witch or a haint did. <laughs> Paint being like a ghost or something. That is, that's weird, man. I mean, the guy that owns this property actually doesn't even live on this property. Um, and the only people that live on this property are literally a, at least a mile and a half that direction through the woods. They were gonna plant ramps out here. You'd think it would just plant them next to their house. That, my friend, is a genuine boner fide mystery. That's what we got right there, we do. Yes, we did. Still by the little ramp place where the witches and the haints are in the woods. I'm back to thinking they might be. Decided to work my way up this path back to the vehicles. And I was walking out this path and I looked down. And there are human footprints right here. That's like a boot print. That was not me. When I came here, I came this direction and messed around the ramp. So someone has walked out here like very, very recently. We're not alone. <laughs> I'm kind of scared. Look at those feathers. Look like a bird exploded coming up through here. Big clump of feathers there. There's more feathers there. Feathers here, feathers there. Feathers on the ground. I don't even know what that is though. I don't know what kind of bird, I guess that's a chicken. I don't know why the feathers would be in the tops of the trees. Path goes this way, that's the way they were headed. I don't see any more feathers. I'm not gonna really try to track it down. But I just thought that was weird. All those feathers up in the trees right here. I got, a, I got something else I got to show you that's really weird, you know. I'm talking about witches and weird stuff in the woods. And footprints that were very fresh, not made by anyone I know. Look over there, there's that weird growth on the tree. Which is unusual, but not that unusual. But anyway, I saw this little rocky area right here. Kind of looked like a nice place if someone just wanted to camp. You know, get out of the wind and stuff. Maybe you can have a fire, it'd be a nice place. I noticed this rock. It looks like it's a big old flat rock covering a hole of some sort in this big thing right here. What do you think that's all about? What's going on here, man? Isn't that bizarre? I mean, there's definitely been a flat rock placed right there. Do we dare to look in? Do you think it's full of like little mummified things? <laughs> you know what? Troll drain. I was gonna say mummified children, but I didn't want to freak anybody out. Um, yeah, um, let's look. <laughs> what do you say? Of course, with me, I'm thinking the mummified children stuff in that hole, but um, I, I can, everyone else will say, no, there's gonna be treasure in there. There's probably a pot of gold. <laughs> gold coins from the Civil War. <laughs> I always think the worst. Okay, all right, here we go. What do you say? <laughs> Man, that is so freaking freaky, dude. Oh, wow. <laughs> Man, that's what it looked like claw marks. Looks like something was in there trying to claw to get out. Man, I hope there's no skulls in there. Human baby skulls. Oh, no. What in the world is that? So we got a hole in a big weird hole in the rock that is has dirt in it, but I wonder what's under the dirt. You see it keeps going. I mean there's um or some type of little devil mouse or something has a hole right there. So it keeps going. I wonder if we should dig that out. What do you think? 
tell you what, I'm gonna go find Bill and bring him up here. Um, if not right now, on our next trip. And we'll take a look at this and see if there's like a part of gold in there. I mean, something mysterious, isn't it? Troll train's talking to us. Got a mysterious hole in the rock that's covered up with a flat rock, like something a, a leprechaun might put over it. So there's either part of gold in there or something's gonna come out of there with a little stabby stabby knife and get us. <laughs> we'll get Bill to help us on this one.